He crawled out from under the canvas and scanned the cavernous space for some place to hide. A voice spoke, chillingly close. Do not move! Oh! Oh, my Anna! D did you hear that? The time has come! We need to hide it! I need to keep the secret! What? Oh, no time to explain! Just believe me! Did he do something again? Are you with me? Yes, but I have no idea what you're dragging us into. Can't you see? This scroll is a great secret. We need to hide it before… Before what? Before he comes! Oh no, this is no good. Oh… This should help. I think it'll work. You'll eat them and then everyone will see the scroll. Oh, you're right. I need to find a place. Yes. Oh, yes. Oh, hurry, Sue. Hide the scroll among the books. Sammy, I'm afraid this is too obvious. Besides, the scroll can get crumpled. Wait. I'm sure I've seen it here. Oh, where was it? Huh. I don't think you fully understand how serious this is! No time for reading! Found it! Chapter 47. Cryptex. It's a combination of cryptography and codex, an apt title for this device, that use the science of cryptology to protect information written on the contained scroll or codex. I don't get it, Sue. It's nonsense! It's exactly what we need, Sam. Sam? I heard you the first time! We should make a cryptex, the only thing to protect the secret! Do you know how? Are you sure? I think I do. It's better to give it a try than to hide under the blanket. Right. It's too dark and hot in there. Let's start. Sam, join me! Are you sure you need me? Absolutely sure. Together, we'll do it faster. Aren't you worried about me? Why is it only me who stays vigilant? All the rest only want to have fun! What are you muttering? You better greet our viewers! Alright! Hello, everyone! Hello! Guys, today we're up for a really serious task. You'd better ask an adult to help you. First, because we're going to be working with sharp tools. Be very careful. We need to cut along the surface of the cardboard lightly. Without cutting it through. And done! Look! The cardboard became flexible. No! I think I can hide the scroll in here! Sammy… It's just the beginning. I promise we'll hide it so that nobody can find it. And now help me. Bring me a lot of glue sticks, please, because we'll need a lot of glue today. But I… But… Oh, fine. I'll be right back. Guys, be careful. It's another sharp item. Ask an adult to help you. By the way… Who helps you with your difficult crafts more often? Your parents or siblings or older friends? Write in the comments! Oh my! I only stepped away for a minute! I'm telling you, nobody in this house can be trusted with keeping secrets safe! Sam, careful. It isn't safe here. But it's not about secrets. It's about a compass, a knife, and scissors. So knives are nothing compared to secrets! And our secrets will be completely safe soon! I don't know, Sue. You're making the safe out of cardboard. Shouldn't safes be metal? I saw that in spy movies. Sam, then it'll be clear we're hiding something. And this will create an impression that we don't have anything like that in the house. Huh, indeed. Very clever. You know, the first safes were found in 13th century BC in Egyptian pyramids. Among the mummies? That's right. In the pharaoh tomb, for example. And the first locks were created by the Romans in the beginning of the new era. So complicated that nobody could create anything better for a thousand years. Wow! But thieves had a thousand years to learn how to break them! Yes. That's why safes were created. Though, when safes first appeared, they were so rare and valuable themselves that they were often valued more than anything inside them. So, the thieves didn't have to break them. They just carried them away. <laughs> and here… Another line there. So, what if somebody carries our crypt… cryptex away? No, no, Sammy. We'll set a complicated code. Nobody will be able to crack it. It's cool that we're going to have this awesome crap… crap… 
the safe, but it looks so complicated! So many details. When you were teaching me to write spy letters, it was much easier and clear. That's so nice of you that you remember that. Guys, do you remember how we wrote secret messages with milk and lemon? Give a thumbs up if you saw that video. And if you didn't, <laughs> go watch it. Huh. This is a bit more complicated, but very fun to make. Look! Sam! These pieces are ready! And what do I do with the scroll until the cryptex is done? Well, you can unfold it and read what it says, for example. Oh my god, Sue! You should pay more attention to what you read. It was made clear. We shouldn't know too much. That's clever. All right. We'll make little cuts here. One. And two. And remove this part. Thanks. I can use this. Uh, what for? I can protect myself if needed. Well, I can protect you too. We're best friends after all. Is it finished yet? Not quite, but we're almost there. Susie, if the first safes were found so long ago, this creep rip text is ancient too? Oh no, Sammy. Actually, it was made up by the author of the Da Vinci Code, the word and the portable safe itself. Oh, so we want to hide my precious scroll and things simply described by a book? Don't worry, Sammy. After the book was out, these cryptexes were made in real life and tried. So it's reliable. Oh, well, fine. When the danger is over, I'll keep other valuable things in there. Things? Uh, <laughs> what things? Come on, Sue! Candies, of course! Indeed. And which candies will you put into a cryptex? Your favorite Skittles and M&Ms? Ugh! Sue, why would anyone keep that in a cryptex? Leave it to Samantha to keep ordinary sweets in a safe away from me. Then what? I have no clue. I need to think. Guys, which things would you keep in a cryptex? Write in the comments. Is it finished? It is, Mr. Sweet Tooth. Are you ready to come up with a code? Yes! I want it to be the most difficult code in the world! <laughs> no, wait. I shouldn't know it. And neither should you. Close your eyes and set a random number. Sam, I had no idea you were so cautious. But how are we going to use it? You wanted to keep candies in here. Oh, it's horrible! Help! Sue, where's the scroll? Did you hide it? No, Sam, I was setting the code. Look, this one should do. Yes, yes. Great code, but the scroll, it was here all this time. Where did it go? Did we lose it for good? No, can't be. I saw it too. <gasps> Wait. I think here. <gasps> How did this get here? Huh. Uh, yes, here it is. Sorry, Sammy. It looks like I brushed it off the table with the rubbish when I was making the cryptex. Sorry. Huh. And someone says it's always me who's making a mess. <laughs> Starting today, Sam, you will be the main keeper of peace and order in the house. Huh. What does that mean? Well, you'll keep the territory safe and all the valuables, too. You mean candies? I'd be happy to. And also tidy up everywhere. Oh, it's great, Sue, but you're a great keeper yourself. <laughs> and this is our crypt text, so you help to save us all, too. <laughs> I appreciate your praise, Sammy, but we aren't finished yet. We need to make sure everything works. Okay, look. To open our safe, you need to set the correct code. There. This is the part where we'll keep things safe. The scroll, in our case. Hop! In you go, mystery scroll. <laughs> These wooden pieces act like a locking mechanism. Let's put it back carefully. Now, if the code is incorrect, let's say, um, this number. Uh-huh. And this. The number of combinations is endless here. The cryptex won't open. See? No code, no scroll. But the right code opens the cryptex easily. Just don't tell this code to Sam's enemy. I'm not even sure who he's hiding this scroll from. <laughs> and there. Aha. Ta-da. And I'll scramble the numbers again. Okay, eight, six, nine. See? <laughs> it works every time. Yay! Ah, now I can stop worrying about my scroll. Well, well, well. It looks really secure. Great job, Susie. Uh-huh. All right. Yahoo! 
Okay, guys, this craft turned out great. If you like it, give a thumbs up. And if you know how to make it even better or using other materials, leave a comment below. While you're doing that, we are moving on to the next craft. What's up, Sam? Well, I need to stash something for two weeks in a cool, dark place. And what is it? I can't tell you. It's a surprise. I don't see a problem. Just hide it and don't tell me where. No, no. I need to hide it from myself, too. Or I might not wait and take it out before it's time. OK. I have no idea what's happening, but I'll help you. For today's craft, I'll need lots of cardboard. What are we making? We'll make a safe, Sam. A safe? Phew! We already made a safe and a crypt text. I know how they work. I'll just crack the code and open it. Do you remember the videos with the safe and the crypt text? Give a thumbs up if you do. It's not just any safe. It has three levels of protection. I'll have the code, and you'll have the key. And we'll start with the combination lock. We'll need four cardboard circles with two centimeters in the diameter. One's done, and here's three more. I'll make one circle out of two so it's easier to spin it. Careful here. We'll be rotating it when entering the code. Let's wrap the edge of the circle carefully so it's more convenient and pretty. Zero, one, two, three. It's just ten digits. What if I guess the code? I really don't think so. We will make five combination locks. Now turn away. I need to think of a good code combination. Hmm, I wonder what it is she will think of. My birthday or hers! This part is a bit bigger in diameter. It'll keep the door closed if the wrong digit is set. What code to set? Huh, I know. This funny part will be the front of the safe, and that's where the locks will be. Let's make some holes for them. And here, the top combination locks will go. Let's set two digits. And I will attach these parts to the other side. I want it to work really well. Right, guys? <laughs> and here, very neatly, glue the parts together. <laughs> Can I turn back already? Just a little longer. I'll make three more locks out of circles that are three centimeters in radius. These locks will work differently. That's why we draw the digits like this on a different side. And to open the safe, you'll need to know three more digits. Not that simple. Now I have to connect these four parts together before attaching them to the safe. Oh, how interesting. I will definitely try to crack your code. <laughs> you can try. A three-digit lock can have 1,000 combinations. We'll attach these three locks to the same front wall. Only a little bit left. Hmm, what code should I set here? Uh-huh. Ah, uh, yes. <laughs> and now let's secure these parts that are two centimeters in radius. Now the lock will only open with the right code. The bolt will be moving on these sticks. And it'll be located here. I'll glue it to the front, right above the revolving parts. And add another support stick for the bolt so it doesn't fall down. These little parts will let us open and close the lock with the correct code. We'll set them right here on the bolt. Oh, I'm too impatient to just stand here and wait. I'll go check on my surprise! This part will prevent the bolt from leaving the safe area. The rubber band will let it get back into place. Now, the key will only move the bolt if the code is entered correctly. You can look now, Sam. Uh, Sam? Sam! Where did you go? One sec, let me just check something. We're getting to the most interesting part. Uh, oh, I'll be right back. Sam's acting really weird. Guys, what do you think he's up to? Write your guess in the comments. I'm back, everything is fine. Great! Now, Sammy, we'll make the key that you will hold on to. My precious! Give it to me, or you'll be able to open my safe. Wait, we'll need it for later to check if everything works. So much 
much waiting. I bet you can't wait to see our save either, guys. Give a thumbs up if I'm right. Be patient, Sammy. These parts will be able to keep the key in the keyhole. Like this. Now I'll need the key to check if our system is working. <gasps> awesome! It works great! Look, Sammy! Yay! I can finally get my key back! Not yet. I'll need it for another lock. Another lock? Yep. We have five combination locks, and we also need to hide them behind the key locks. Let's make this part. I'll let the key grant access to the top two combination locks. I need a rubber band. And attaching it here. And one more part for the support. Gotta be careful. And glue it right here. And pull the rubber band to the side, like this. Now everything starts with your key. I just need to finish the front of the safe and build the body. And you bring whatever you need to hide. Awesome! Finally! I'll go get it, but don't you peep. Let's add some decorations to our safe. I said decorations! Sam! Huh. Usually he runs when he hears this word. Oh well. Do, 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 do. It's time to put the safe together. This part will be the bottom. I'll attach the door with the locks right here in the middle. Just a drop of glue. These hooks won't let you open three bottom locks unless the code is entered on the top. And one more. The last three locks will be hidden behind this door. And this is how it works. This is the side wall. Let me glue it to the bottom. And it has two doors. This door is opened by the key, and there are two combination locks behind it. And the keyhole for Sam's key is behind the second door. Here I am! Is everything ready? One minute, Sammy. I need to attach the most important part while you'll be storing your items, and also the walls. This door can only be opened if you know the combination and have the key. I have the key and it's so pretty! Psst, guys, did you see Sue's code? Write me in the comments! <gasps> Sam! Sorry, I can't wait to get my surprise inside! I'll set up the bottom and the wall. Here you'll be keeping your things. Cool, I think it'll be dark enough. Enough for what? Nothing, nothing. Ah. <sighs> And the back is ready. And let's get the top in place. Done! Our safe is ready! Wow! So wonderful! So cool! And secure. Should we open it to hide your surprise? Let's turning and opening! Yay! Now turn away. I'll enter the code. Oh my! Turning again! Oh, what was the code? Aha! Uh -huh. Mm-hmm. Done. So awesome! Uh, it won't open! <laughs> of course! Uh, wait, that's not it. Uh, turn away. We have three more locks. Here. Now I need your key, Sammy. Finally! Thank you. Let's see here. And turn. And now you can put whatever you want in here. Now you turn away. Fine. Now we close it. Okay, Sammy. Now I just need to do the same, but in reverse order. It's so cool, guys. I feel like I'm walking away something very valuable. And I'm pretty sure it's not. <laughs> guys, what would you store in a safe? Write a comment below. It's been two weeks! We can open the safe now and see what happens!
Sam, what's that? Take it out and see! Uh, are these raisins? Yes, two weeks ago, I put away grapes. And now they've become yummy, sweet raisins! <laughs> so yummy. I was afraid I'd eat it before it was ready. <laughs> That's why the say. Hmm, it really is delicious. So, did you like the safe, Sammy? Very much so. And so many different locks. You'll never open it without the code and the key. Did you guys like the safe? Write in the comments below. And subscribe to the channel to see our new crafts. Guys, if you want to get to know Sam better, comment below and we'll tell you even more funny stories of his life. And uh, while you're doing that, we'll show you another cool thing. That's not it either. <gasps> hey, guys! I decided to treat Susie and give her a present. Oh, I want to buy her a set of LOL dolls! Here, that's the right thing. I just need to find some money. Hmm, let's check how much I saved. Huh, uh, not much, actually. Ooh, I'm not good at saving, but I really want to give Sue a present! Oh, then Sue is the one who can help me. Sue! Sue! I really need your help. I would be happy to, but what happened? Um, oh, I urgently need another piggy bank for coins and cash. Huh, a piggy bank for coins and cash? Sounds interesting. Let's give it a try. Yay! Now I have a chance to fulfill my plan! And meanwhile, you can write in the comments below what other piggy banks of mine you remember. Here. I have found all the necessary stuff. Woohoo! It seems that it will be a really cool project. <laughs> right you are, Sam. Hmm, something's missing here. Uh, Sam, could you please fetch me some barbecue sticks from the kitchen? I can feel something awesome coming! <laughs> so, there are thin and thick sticks. Which ones do you need? Uh, you can bring both. I'm back! And why do you need these sticks? You'll see. Would you like to see some magic? Sure I do! A bibbity bobbity Boo! Oh, I can only! My turn! Whoosh! <gasps> oh, wow! <sighs> That's even better! Oh, that slime sweet tooth! So we have to install bicycle spoke fragments into pen pieces. Just like this. Already done! Wow, that looks great, Sammy! Now we need to tape the handles. Ouchie! Sue, could you please do it yourself? This tape, I don't like it. <laughs> okay, Sammy. Can you even imagine how many different tapes there are in the world? Hmm. Now we measure the necessary length on popsicle sticks. We need two similar parts. It's good that I like ice cream. Otherwise, we would be short on sticks. <laughs> right. We couldn't do it without you, Sammy. The stick goes here. Hmm, what is it? Patience, you'll know soon. Oh. And here we insert our pen into this part like this. Looks like, um, what actually is it, Sue? So we measure a circle with the compass. We will need two of those and a smaller one. Sam, do you want to cut out the circles? <laughs> no, this is way too easy for me. Oh, would you look at him? Then maybe you can help me stick them to each other? <laughs> Leave it to a true master. <laughs> Go ahead, Sam. I am sure you will need this. Oh, thanks, Sammy. You are 100% right. <laughs> what did I say? Professionals always have everything on hand. <laughs> Sue, are you sure that in the end we will have a piggy bank and not a car? Of course, Sammy. Look, Sam, we have a challenge here. Can you tackle it? Sure. I can even do it with my eyes closed. You are doing such a great job, Sam. A real pro. Oh, yes, that's me. Um, be careful with the cutter, Sam. <laughs> Whatever, I'm a pro, did you forget? Sam, since you want to store cash as well, are you saving for something big? Uh, do 
don't ask me. Otherwise, I'll tell you and the surprise will be ruined. Okay, okay. I won't. Here, you have to be careful since we need to cut only the upper and middle cardboard layer. This is a peculiar piggy bank. I'm very excited to use it. Just a little more patience. It'll be ready soon. Uh, a piggy bank with windows? This looks even cooler than the magical one. Really? I think that the magical piggy bank was very beautiful. Could you please pass me the pencil so I can fold this piece nicely? Here you go. Let's wrap this piece around the pencil. Just look how nice it is. And now we stick it right here. Guys, don't forget about safety when working with glue guns. One can easily get burned. I'm not afraid of anything, but I still trust you with such things. Uh, what happened, Sue? Uh, Is something missing? Yes, two round pieces of cardboard. Could they be in the box? They were on the floor, but I picked them up. Oh, thank you, Sammy. Sue, that looks familiar. Those wheels with sticks inside. I'm sure I've seen it before. Seriously? Where? I'm thinking, thinking, trying to remember. You'll remember it for sure. See, there's a handle here. You can spin it if you like. I'm also sure that I have spinned something like this before. Whoa! We have constructed almost the same thing for one of our money banks! Oh yeah! That was a good money bank. By the way, where is it? It… it is… Uh, somewhere is saving money. That's what it's made for. Well, I hope that's so. Look how cool it is. Wanna try? It is fun to turn this handle, but I would like to start saving money. For the next step, I made these thingies. It looks like a little swing! Are we making a playground for money? A swing, you say? I call it a trampoline rather than a swing. Trampoline! I want to jump on one of those. Me too. I could play on those all day long. Now the rubber band goes into this little hook. It's to wait until the glue is dried. But we can always stick it once more. Sure, but it's better when things are working the first try. Do you want to see how the coins will jump on our trampoline? Absolutely! Oh boy, that's awesome! Now it's looking more like a real piggy bank. A bit weird though. I can't wait to see it! Well, you asked me for an unusual one for coins and cash, so nothing's weird here. However, I might surprise you now. Sam, remember when you wanted to be a spy? Oh, sure. Why are you asking me about it now? Because we'll make a spy combination lock. Wow! And it'll even have a code? Of course! Not a hard one. Really easy to remember. I already thought I would have to carry around a paper with a password. Sammy, could you please help me one more time? Make a snip right here. I'm on it. Done! It was a piece of cake. Good job! Look what I made. It would serve as the second part for our lock. Sam, which letter is your favorite? The letter C for candy! You know it perfectly well. Awesome! Then we'll use it. But don't tell anyone. Now we'll stick the back part to our piggy bank. Only the lock support is left. And voila! The piggy bank is done! So, Did you just say that the piggy bank is done? I sure did! I, I, Susie! I'm just kidding. We can't do without the decoration. Phew! Susie, don't scare me like that. A craft without a decoration? Well, you know. I do, I do. Boom! Now the mission is complete. Let's test it! Come on, Susie! Hurry up and put my money in there so I can start saving! No problem! Wait, what's this? Aw, what a nice LOL set! Oh, oh no! You shouldn't have seen it! I, I wanted to buy it for you as a present! Aw, oh, that's 
That's why you're saving the money? You're so <laughs> sweet, Sammy. Ah, uh, Sue, you're my best friend. And I wanted to make you happy. <laughs> then let's fill our piggy bank quick to get happy together. And it goes. Wow! And a coin. Oh! <laughs> Some more. Yeah. Amazing. <laughs> uh, boop. Oh, it's a great start. Guys, if you would like to see the unpacking of this LOL set when I save enough money, please write in the comments below. Don't forget to click the bell button not to miss our next video. And if you like our brand new piggy bank, click the like button. Bye, guys. See you soon. I think it's all right if Sam saves for this LOL set a little faster. Good deeds should be rewarded. <laughs>